All right, here we go. And I got the blade for the, uh, from the B20 725. This is the actual genuine, authentic, original blade to that band that used to be that band. The only thing they kept in production after it was gone was the original blade and the knob. Well, I got the original blade and I have the knob. So we're gonna put it on this Air King. And now what's left of it is gonna be in the body of the Air King, which is a 9723. So now the model number becomes the B20-725-9723. Or the, or the Air King 9723-B20-725. Whatever you wanna look at it. But that's what it is, meaning the blade and the knob. So this is gonna wrap up this um, production. This has been something I've been trying to do for a while. I got those other blades, but unfortunately those blades just go to the high velocity ones that you see in the studio already. So this is gonna be the original blade with the knob on this Air King 9723 B2725. And uh, let's go ahead and get started. Here we go. Yes, the same design, but the set screw is in the front instead of in the back. For the high velocity fans, it's in the back, but in the front, it's mounted in the front. I guess that's the only slight difference. This is the original blade that was actually on the fan. Thankfully, they kept it in stock because and they kept it in production. I mean, isn't it obvious? It's the same fan blade you see on all the high velocity fans, with the only exception with the set screw being in, in the front. Now, I hope it's well balanced. Don't count on that, that's gonna do nothing right. And it probably wasn't balanced when that fan was out anyway. So let's see what we got. Put it on the bed so it don't get damaged.
Okay, I think you guys can see it better. Let me go ahead and set it up so I'm going to adjust the camera where you guys can see it. Set it up. Huh? Let's see what we got. I do apologize if it's out of the view a little bit. I think that's the best I can do. I hope y'all can see that. I'm going to have to clean the blade up. It got some dust on it from when I was using it. But I'll do that off camera. I can Has a really good spin down time. Sure hope it keeps that same spin down time. Wow, look at that thing go. Long spin down time.
perfect. Got it right the first time. That's what happens when you have the set screw in the front. It's always better than in the back. That's all it took. There you go. That's the original blade. Let's hope that spin down is the same. Oh, it didn't go back all the way. Thank God. Okay, so that's it. That's pretty much it. The original blade from the original fan in the body of a 9723 Air King because that's what's left of the B20 725. If you would like to make yourself one of these, well, buy the 9723 Air King, take the stinking plastic blade off, and order this blade right here through the Lasco website. Go to the Lasco website and go to where it says parts and type in B20725, order the knob and the blade, Watch my video and do the same thing, and you will have yourself one as well. A modern-day metal-bladed box fan. What used to be the B2725 now lives on in the Air King. The only difference is it's not real loud because of that ball bearing motor, and the air is still decent. There you go. Let me put the cover back on. We'll do a final test. And there you go. I'm going to have to lay it down, so I'll try to adjust it where you guys can see it. Pretty sure you guys can see that quite well. All right. Great. Stinking battery died, so now I'm gonna try to use a stinking handheld. 
never a dull moment, right, Jordan? That's what you say, right? Huh? Well, stinking drill died on me. So now I gotta charge the battery overnight. I apologize. It's taking longer than usual. It's thinking drill died on me. So when I'm done with this recording, I gotta charge it overnight. But that's just how it is. It only, it only came with one battery. I suppose I could try to find the model number of it and look into getting a second battery. So when one dies, the other one is charged. I know what you think it was. That's what you should have did when you first bought it if you knew it came with one drill. Okay, I don't need the argument. I don't need all of that. I don't need the drama in the comments. I, I don't want to have to block nobody. I'll look into that later. Thank you very much. Just try to enjoy the video.
I'll be right back. Okay, let's continue. Okay, let's do a final test one and see what we got. I hope y'all can see it okay. If not, I do apologize for um, not being able to see it well. The white guard got kind of does hide the metal blades because the metal blades are silver. The guard is white. And unfortunately, that's just how it is. I wasn't able to acquire the, uh, the front and back guard with the screws. I wish I could, but they didn't have that no more. Yeah, obviously, it's, that's inevitable, isn't it? If it has not been produced anymore. The only thing Lasco is still producing is the blade and knob. It doesn't cost so much to produce that. And people just need those two parts. So because of that, it kind of makes it hard to be able to see it. But hopefully you can see it good enough. I'll try to zoom it a little bit more. It might be out of the picture a little bit. My apologies. Okay, well, I mean, it's out of the picture just slightly, but hopefully you guys can see it a little bit better. All right, let's do a final test run and let's see what we got. I'm not going to rock it back and forth. I've already done that. The blade is all right. Actually does have a startup sound. It's interesting. That never was the case on the B2725 one with that ball bearing motor. It is the case with this PSC motor. Uh, this uh, Shady Pro PSC or whatever. PSC uh, sleep bearing motor. Enjoy it. Guy's not gonna be able to hear the wind stream. I do apologize. If you do, that's good. Well, Eli Lasco, here is my version. Of which you still have the B2725, but unlike yours, it's not obnoxiously loud because it's running off of a ball bearing motor. But this is what's left of it. So there you go. At least I got the original blade in the knob now. There you go. There's definitely a significant difference in speed change and airflow, so I'm happy about that. One of the main things you mentioned, uh, Eli Lasso, is that um, the speeds are not really all that different because that's a high velocity fan blade with the set screw in the front. And plus, it was on a ball bearing powerful motor. On so this one, that's not the case. Speed is different and the airflow. Speed it back up to full power and then we're gonna slow it down and that's gonna be it for this video. And it's gonna stay in service because it's hot in the studio.
there is a extremely faint or slight out of balance about it, but it's not terribly bad. It's very slight, like very little. I'm guessing that's probably what it was with the original B2725. Because you know, Lasco never makes no blade right. Full power, and then the spin down. All right, let's see what we got. Spin down time. Nice, beautiful spin down time, super long. Those blades are heavier. That's why the spin down time is a lot longer. That's what happens when you have heavier blades. You get a longer spin down time. And I hope you enjoyed the video. There you go, there is what's left of the B2725 and a 9723 Air King body. All right, that's it. So if you want to buy that fan today, well, this is the way to do it because it's no longer in production, but the blade and the knob is in production. You get yourself a 9723 Air King like this, take out the plastic blade, do just like what I did, and you got yourself one. You can still get the B2725 today this way. I'm not the fan, man, and out.